Well, thanks, Darren and Jill. I'm Stephen Human. Now, while you guys are enjoying a very modern adventure on the motorcycles in the Dakotas, I am going the exact opposite direction. I am having a very Western adventure. Right now, I'm in the wilds of Duchesne County at one ranch that has developed a day trip program that will turn you into an Old West Wrangler. Turning north off of Highway 40 in Duchesne County, you quickly find yourself on the forgotten paths of yesteryear, where the beauty is unspoiled and the terrain is wild. The farther you go, the deeper you get into this world, until you discover a sign that points you toward the Western experience you've been searching for, something new and old in the form of the Reed Ranch. You know, the Reed Ranch was uh, bought by my parents back in 1978. There was nothing here except a uh, framed building with no water. There was uh, electricity here. From then on, we've grown where we can have capacity of 200 people and in our lodges and 500 in our camping area. The ranch has been a go-to for family reunions and church groups looking for plenty of activity and accommodations that range from rustic to revitalizing. Now, however, they've branched out to something new, inviting everyone to come out and spend a day getting in touch with their cowboy and cowgirl alter egos. This is my seventh summer doing here, and even just the time I've been working here, we've had multiple inquiries of like, oh, can I bring a, a family member up for the day, or people who've come up for tours just to check the place out, like, oh, do you guys do day trips? And for a long time, we've, we didn't do it, but this year we're like, okay, you know, we're going to branch out and we're going to do these day trips where people can come up for a few hours and experience going on a horseback ride, do the paddle boating, experience the lake, kind of more of the western feel of doing things up here. You know, we're only uh, two hours from Salt Lake City, and what a great opportunity to get a feel of the West, where you can have a four-hour excursion, you get a barbecued lunch, you get the opportunity of taking an hour horse ride, you get the opportunity to learn how to lasso or learn how to canoe or play miniature golf up here in the mountains. It's the highest probably 8,000 foot miniature golf course around and uh, just have a wonderful time, especially to learn how to uh, shoot archery. Bullseye! I'm talking about. And you'll just take it, and then you just take it above your head, and you just kind of, it's like wrist motion, there you go. And you kind of spin around in a circle. That didn't work. There you go. Oh! oh. Came off. You see that? Before this story is over to come, the rest of the story is me roping this thing. I'm going to do it. <laughs> and, oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Nicely done. All right, so uh, where are we going? We're just going to take a ride in the lake. And a boat. You agree with that? Sure. Obviously, there are a lot of activities here at the ranch to take advantage of on a day trip. But if that's all you do, you're only scratching the surface. The Highway 40 corridor that runs through Duchesne County drops you on the doorstep of any number of other adventures within a half hour of each other. That's the beauty of the day trip program here. It's perfect for someone exploring the area to base out of a town like Duchesne and hit a number of destinations over a couple of days. It turns what would otherwise be a one-stop trip into a multi-day itinerary that covers activities for all types of thrill seekers. Once they come here for their day excursion and if they're staying in Duchesne, there's Starvation Reservoir, there's Dinosaur National Monument in Vernal. What an incredible area out in the high windows. There are so many things to see, so many things to do, and we recommend people come out into the basin and experience it. Coming out for a day like this always ends up being about more than just riding a horse or paddling in the water. New experiences have a way of strengthening bonds that we didn't even know needed to be strengthened. Plus, you're in a place that invites exploration away from everything else where all you can concentrate on is the beauty of the area and the people by your side. It gives them a chance to unplug, reconnect with people. I've seen families who've come up here not really talking and they leave completely like best friends again. Like they're like, oh, we, you know, we need to do this more often and get together. And that's, that's the most rewarding thing for me is just to see how it, close it just brings people together. What an incredible opportunity for an excursion just two hours out of Salt Lake City. Today has been an absolute blast. I've had so much fun here at the Reed Ranch, and you can find out more about it at reedranch.com. It's really easy to find. It's right off of Highway 40 there at mile marker number 62. You just head north from the Big G, that sort of shopping complex that they have right there in Fruitland. You head north on that. It's about 14 miles off the highway. Most of it's dirt road, but easily passable. Well, I'm Stephen Human for At Your Leisure. We need to take a commercial break right now, but when we come back, we'll have this week's product review. 
Hey guys, if you like that video, you're going to want to watch all of our other AYL videos. You're going to want to like it, you're going to want to share it, and you're going to want to subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're going to want to do, click, right? Click, click, click. on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why are you going to sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you want to click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.